right, so Attack on Titan. Yeah, the last two episodes were just crazy. Aaron's head got 360 Uh He really was over here just talking to Grisha. Like, we're, aren't, aren't you supposed to be killing those kids right now? You know, taking the founding Titan. Like, he was just on him. Like, yeah, really made him scared over here just... I mean, he was just traumatized, you know, and somehow he was able to see Zeke, was able to hear Aaron, like, wasn't that just supposed to be a memory? So how is he able to hear them? So, you know, I really don't know how that happened, but yeah, just a lot happened. And yeah, the Attack Titan had another power, or at least, yeah, because Attack Titan, I thought it was just literally like, yeah, just straight hands, you know, like just literally in the name just strictly for attacking like that's what it's best at but no it did have its own like special power and that was like you know just looking through the future so and i i think i, I was thinking about this so when he um was getting his medal after like the end of season three when he was getting his medal you know of recognition from historia and he kissed her hand right because she has royal blood i was just thinking that's probably when he saw all these memories it was like oh this is what's gonna happen in the future so that's most likely what would have changed him then but that's just me i don't know for sure but yeah i'm gonna just start it up here yeah just see where it's going to happen now but yeah hope you guys will enjoy this make sure to like subscribe and yeah let's get this reaction started all right here we go with frida oh gosh okay so it's just showing us a more in-depth look of like what happened during her fight. Yeah, she already lost, yeah. He's on top of her, yep, took off that arm. Yeah, that's about it already. Oh, just what I was talking about. When he kissed her hand, yep, he got those memories. And that's what changed him. Yep, unable to reproduce. So is that her... Oh no, he, well, he's still chained up. But yeah, exactly what I was talking about. Like, yeah, what he saw with Historia. Wow. He's about to, like, just. Yeah, rip off his own hands just to. Go. Yep, tore off half of his hand. So once she's begun to move, guess when it's already in effect. No one in the world can stop her. Okay. Yep, so let's see. Yeah, because, I mean, Grisha did say Aaron was going to get what he wants, and yeah, it's not going to go Zeke's way. But yeah, we got this. Oh, from you, two thousand years ago. So yeah, about when it started. Yeah, let's see. Okay. So this is Yumir's backstory. 
So like how I said 2,000 years ago. So they came, burned down their houses, killed some of them. So what, yeah, let's see. How did all this begin? And how is she connected with all this? Like how is she just the founder? Every one of you loses an eye. They have no need for two. Okay, who they're pointing at? On her! For letting a pig escape. Yeah, she's like, hold up, y'all just pinning it on me? And look, she's like the only kid there, really. Or the youngest one. You are free? Okay. Oh, so free, but yeah, they're, 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 we're still gonna chase you down. That's just messed up. For one pig. Yeah. Oh, and fell in the water. And did she just drown? Yeah, there's no way she getting back up. Oh, what is that at the bottom? I see something moving. Okay. Looks like a what a spine oh and that turned her into a titan then yeah like okay and I guess that's just how it all started Or no, did they use her? He built roads, cultivated the winds, or wilds, and bridged the mountains. My tribe Eldia has grown quite large. I shall give you my seed. And this is how I got passed down and kept on reproducing. Yep. Yeah, I see it now. And then they uh, were going against Marley at the time. See, so yeah, of course, that ongoing war technically, like, yeah, it's not like they're fighting now. Uh, I mean, currently now, yes. But, like, you know, during the time, you know, when Aaron was, like, younger, not then. But, yeah, still, they just hated Eldia in general. Oh! Oh, and she took the blow. Straight to the heart. Just to save the king.
And they just chopped her. Sis, Ma Maria, Rose, and Cena. The names of the walls. And those are like the main ones. It's like... I, I get what he was doing trying to pass on the power, but the eat... He just chopped her up and ate her. Yeah. So she was like the first time, but how did like the other spe like Titan powers come to be? Let's see, what is she making? Okay. And yeah, I see some type of Titan there from what she's building. Oh, well, no, there it goes. So she just made the other, like, Titan. Like, the special Titans. The Colossal, the Beast, and all. And she's just been here for... Yeah, for years. And now you get to see the face, or at least the eyes. Okay. Oh, and there it goes again, the spine looking thing. Coming from his head. Oh! Wait, no, he's still... Sort of alive? Oh, and there goes the other Titans. Yep, in the walls. Yeah. So I guess, yeah, the rumbling has started now. Because the walls are finally just destroyed now, yeah. Titans are out of there. Free. After so long. Oh, this is something I definitely need to read. The origin of Titans. According to legend, the founder Ymir attained the power of the Titans when coming into contact with something. They don't even got a name for it. Yeah, it's just some random thing floating in the water in some big tree. Yeah, or under some big tree. Yeah. But for generations, her blood and power were passed down by the Yodians. Yes, we clearly saw how they pass it down that's just wrong for especially for kids to be eating it or eating her like that <sighs> yeah um but yeah let's just continue however the identity of that something which began it all remains unknown it may have been some type of pathogenic parasite maybe a god who pitied the founder Ymir and gave her power or something else entirely. Yeah, it might just be a parasite. Uh, yeah, especially how it was looking like. Or especially how they got it drawn right here too. But yeah, god who pitied Ymir gave her power. Okay. Well, uh, no, actually, I don't think it was the special Titan power that she was making. It was the other ones, I guess. You know, inside these walls. Since they do look the same of what she was... Yeah, these signs right here look the same of what she was making.
Hear me, subjects of Yumir. His name is Aaron Yeager. Okay, to address all of them. This is just crazy. I've undone the hardening of Paradise Island's walls. And the Titans have begun their march. So protect the people of Paradise Island, the place he was born. Okay, well... The world wants to exterminate my people, not just on the island. They will not stop until every last subject or Eldian is gone. Okay. Yeah, that image is something else. To be continued. Yeah, okay, let me go back to that. Look at him. Yeah, he has changed. So I guess, yeah, Yumir just needed someone to really just be there with her, I guess, and understand her pain. I don't know exactly, but yeah, she's been there for a while, so... Yeah, definitely was lonely. And then, like, yeah, is Aaron, like, whatever he's saying right here, is that true? Like, yeah, did she actually lead him there? Like, you know, because she was just lonely and was like, you know, let me just have someone to comfort me, I guess. I don't know, understand my pain. So is he alive? Like... Because he really could just be saying all this from the coordinate right now, still with Yumir. And somehow just relaying this message over to them. Or like, no, he like really came back to life and is actively just doing all this. But no, he started the rumbling. Yeah, that's it. But this is just weird right here. They really chopped her up and just passed down that power. So really, to be honest, if a pig, <laughs> one pig, wasn't let loose by someone either on purpose or on accident, None of this would be going on. They wouldn't be chasing Yumir. She wouldn't have found this random tree, you know, fell down, almost drowned, and finally, you know, be that one. Or not finally, but um, almost drowning and then, you know, becoming this titan out of nowhere. Like, none of this would have happened just because of a single pig. You know, if not that, or unless... She just would have gotten killed on the spot there, or she just, like, it, it's many things that could have happened other than, you know, like, um, when she was getting chased, like, they, they could have taken her out, you know, um, she could have just took her own self out, maybe, you know, there's a lot of things that could have happened there. Or she probably could have found some other people that actually gave her that love, like, not being a slave, like, no, she was actually going to have, or, uh, be loved, you know, and actually just not get treated like a slave, you know, get forced, I mean, how was he, like, you know, a good 40, 50 when he made Yumir have his child, like, all of this is just messed up, but it's like, he wanted to continue it, like, because that power is just going to his head like most people. So it's like, you can see how powerful she is. So you would obviously, as a king with your slaves and all that and in these times, you know, show like who's really the one with the power. Of course, you would want more of that and just make sure you have that status. 
But yeah, man, this this was just one up. I mean, like, the, what do we got for the next? So I'm gonna just end it off here, and yeah, we'll, I'll just see you guys in the next one. He's sacrificing a lot just to protect Eldians. And once he takes care of everybody else, including the rest of the world, it's like Eldians are all that stuff. Like, yeah, they can really keep on reproducing and just sort of, yeah, get all those other millions or billions of people, however much there are in this world right now. But. Okay. Oh, there's still some more titans going against the soldiers. But, yeah, they just have to take a while just to get all those Eldians back or just whatever. If he's just gonna end up killing everybody. Only cause more conflict. What can they do now? <laughs> what is Reiner gonna do? No, that's the cart titan. Like, she needs the guns on her back. You know, those cannons. Okay. Yeah, only cause he ate Burhold. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not saying the cart titan bad, like peak is bad. But I'm just like, what can she really do apart from having those other soldiers on her back? Shooting those cannons and guns. The Reiner, he's always getting beat up, like, you know. Oh, but this time she's the one who's gonna be attacked instead of her mom. Yeah. Yeah, Sasha's gone. Okay. Oh, that that had to been Gabby. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I guess that was her moment to redeem herself. Go straight for that head. Oh no, straight in the mouth, no? Okay. Yeah, now the same soldier I was talking about. You may never see his wife and what was it, daughters or just children in general. You won't be able to see him again. Okay. Who came to save him? Oh, is that, uh, who is it, Keith? Okay. Yep. Follow him. Yeah, right now, it's just like, let bygones be bygones. It doesn't matter who we're fighting with, who we're helping out. It's like, just, right now, we need to survive and get out of here. All right, and I got my OSC, okay. Yeah. Just go crazy. Yeah, just get up on out of there. Okay. Oh, Pixis. Yeah. Someone important. Yeah, that's helped him through a lot. There's just no time to wait for him to turn back. Yeah. One of the big reasons they made it so far. Okay. Well, at least we get to see the corpse. Yeah, Keith just... All of them working together like this. 
It'll be like one of the last songs you'll probably see this. So yeah, just go all out. Yes, sir. So she's free now. Wow, okay, the next couple of episodes are gonna be real interesting. So that means Annie, after all of this time, freaking like what, three seasons, almost that long, she is finally coming back and is going to be in action. Yeah, she kept quiet all this time. But I don't even know if any of that, like, it would have mattered. Like, we would have learned about Marlian's way ahead of time. But it's still probably, like, all of this would have still probably would have happened anyways. Yeah, man. <laughs> Bro, this is... So, no, Reiner's hardening was undone. Meaning, yeah, Annie, like, when she hardened herself, that would have been undone as well. But does that mean her powers are gone? Like, no, I think they still have the powers. Just anything that has to do with, like, hardening, you know, like, the walls, all of that's just undone. But they still do have their powers, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. Well, hey, at least we got to see them in action. The Survey Corp here doing their thing. Having to take out people that just... They never would have even thought of becoming Titans. Yeah, taking out Pixis for ever since Season 1. Having to take him out. It's like... He would have been the perfect person to really lead them and guide them. Throughout all of this right now and once it at least has settled down, but I'm pretty sure this is not settling down for a while now like Aaron He just has all of this power Like who can really stop him? Yes I don't know But yeah, Connie he went off with Falco. Yeah, they're just long gone now. Yeah four years is a while like, she's just sitting there that whole time in a titan form. It's just like, yeah, that's just... Yeah, what do you do? All you can do is just go see her out of all those years and just say, like, hey, you know, like, what's been going on, you know, during that time and just, you know, go back. Just, yeah... So it's like, basically, yeah, she was suffering that whole time, even though she's in Titan form. So, you know, it's the, it's, she's thinking kind of differently. But, yeah, just having to stay there that whole time, not being able to really move her. Yeah. Like, what else can you really do? But, yeah, we got about... Yeah, because this part two has 12 apps. And we're on, yeah, so we got like six apps left. Well, we'll just have to see what happens next. Yeah, the rumbling, I guess, yeah, has now started. Because from how I saw it, yeah, just basically, you know, all the Titans just come out the walls. And then, you know, they just go attack Marley. Or at least, uh, if they came to Paradise and attacked, he would have just set all the Titans free. So, yeah, it has now finally started. And... Just really nothing we can really do about it, but yeah, as it winds down, and yeah, part three, yeah, we have that, so yeah, there's still more story to tell, so we'll probably have to see more of what's going to happen then, but yeah, for now, we'll just have to see what happens in these next six episodes, but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this, make sure you have a like, subscribe again, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.